Hello and welcome to this AmCrest tutorial that shows you how to add your Pro HD HD series camera to the iSpy security camera software. iSpy is open source software and compatible with cameras from many different manufacturers, including AmCrest. If you don't have a specific reason to use iSpy, or only have AmCrest cameras, we recommend using AmCrest Surveillance Pro. It is free and available on amcrest.com forward slash support. AmCrest Surveillance Pro is the official surveillance software to use on your PC or Mac and will be easier to set up, is more powerful, and has better support from us. Otherwise, if you already use iSpy and like it, or you'd like to bring together multiple cameras from different manufacturers, please continue watching. Let's get started by downloading iSpy. Go to Google, then search iSpy. Click the first link. From here, click one of the download buttons on the left. Choose 32-bit or 64-bit based on your computer. If you don't know which to choose, just select the 32-bit download. It will now save to your downloads folder. I'll be saving it to my desktop. Next, locate your download, then extract it. Now, you can run the setup. Double-click the installer to continue. Make sure to check the box next to I agree to the license terms and conditions, then click Install. Once it's finished, click Launch. You can close out of the Getting Started window by clicking OK on the bottom right. Now, we can start adding the camera by clicking the Add button on the top left. Select IP Camera from the list. Here, start by entering the login credentials in the top two fields. Now, in order to get the camera to show up in iSpy, we will need to add it to the software using the ProHD's MJPEG URL. You can think of this as a command that tells your camera to provide a raw video stream without needing to log in through the traditional interface. This is how you get your camera to talk to iSpy. It is important to note that the following command must be written exactly as shown. If there is one character out of place or that is incorrect, this will not work. I will walk you through typing this in correctly, and you can also find the URL in the description of this video, along with an example URL that one would use for their own camera. Start by entering HTTP colon forward slash forward slash, then your camera's IP address. You can use the Amcrest IP config tool to find this. Ours will be 192.168.1.81. Then, without any spaces, type forward slash A X I S axis hyphen C G I forward slash M J P G forward slash video dot C G I. This is what the finished URL should look like. Make sure to double check that yours is correct. Keep in mind that your camera's IP address may be different, so you will not enter the same numbers that I entered in the beginning. Yours may be 192.168.2.44 or 192.168.1.104. Make sure to confirm what your own camera's IP address is and do not copy what I have entered. Once you're done here, click OK in the bottom right. If entered correctly, you'll notice that now your camera feed appears in the background, but iSpy is now giving you the option to go through and configure a few more things before taking you back to the viewing screen. On this first camera tab, you should name your camera. There are several other settings on this page for you to play with. You can also set up motion detection, alerts, recording, PTZ, images, FTP, cloud storage, scheduling, and storage. When you're finished, click Finish. Now, you can click and drag your feed to move it around. Double click it to go full screen, and you can also use your mouse's scroll wheel for digital zoom. If you need help with any configuration or control option on iSpy, please check out the help section here. Additionally, you can reach out to their customer support. You will need to register an account to fill out the contact form. You can also browse their forums and frequently ask questions to find more answers. That's all there is to it. Thanks for watching, and please be sure to subscribe to our channel if you'd like to see more tutorial videos like this one from Amcrest Technologies.